Hey, it's Luxury Travel Docs here today, and let me welcome you to the maiden voyage of P&O's newest ship, the Arvia. We arrived today in Southampton, and let me just tell you, you cannot miss this ship. It is massive, and it has the signature P&O Cruises Union Jack painting on the side. It has 18 decks and a capacity of about 6,000. So because of this size, it's going to take a little bit of time for us to fully explore the ship. But what I wanted to do today, of course, is welcome you. This is room 15732 called a smaller balcony room. We found that the balcony really isn't smaller than other balconies, but the room itself is small. It's much smaller than a standard inside cabin. These rooms are scattered around most decks, usually in an aft location and this room is located aft on deck 15. The beds in this room are configured in a queen configuration with very small bed stands located beside each bed. There are outlets in the wall with USB ports located in the bottom of each lamp. There is a desk beside the bed with a chair and some cabinets. There are additional outlets there with a kettle and a supply of tea and coffee. There are some small shelves and when you look in the cabinet below the kettle, there is a small refrigerator available. There are no shelves in this cabinet. There really is not a lot of storage available in this room. There is a small wardrobe located by the door, which we will look at in just a second. Opposite the bed is a large television with a selection of various channels and movies on it. And below that, there is a very small shelf with some additional cabinets available to you that are not very deep. As we head into the bathroom, you will love the beautiful wooden floor located in there with a nice shower door. There is a removable nozzle for those who might have mobility issues with a retractable clothesline in the shower. There is plenty of shelf space and towel racks for your use. Products are provided by White Company Goods with a pump bottle of hand wash by the sink and pump bottles of shampoo and body wash in the shower. There are hooks located by the door and if you're someone like us who likes to bring magnetic hooks, you may not need them. In the wardrobe, there is a full length mirror on the right side with a top shelf mostly occupied by your life vest. There are the darn anti-theft hangers available. Ask your steward if you would like additional free hanging hangers. You can put your shoes in the bottom of the wardrobe. The only real storage that you have in this cabin is the additional wardrobe by the door. In it you'll find a small safe where you can fit some small valuables, a tablet, and perhaps a small laptop. There are a few recessed shelves in this wardrobe as well. The balcony is large and can fit two chairs and a table easily. There is lots of privacy from the neighboring cabins, cabins above and below you, and there is an unobstructed view. Always remember to make meaningful and healthy travel happen. And thanks for joining us. We'll see you next time from the maiden voyage of P&O's newest ship, the Arvia.